it's Morgan, dietitian and personal trainer at Live Healthy MD. Today we're going to talk about vegan diet for bariatric patients. As a bariatric patient, we all know protein is most important. If you decide you want to go vegan, meaning you no longer want to eat animal products, that's okay, but still you want to make sure you get enough protein and fill up on fiber and a lot of non-starchy veggies. If you decide you want to switch to an omnivore, no, I'm sorry, herbiv herbivore. If you're deciding you want to switch to being an herbivore, that's okay, just make sure you get enough protein. Now, once you switch over to the vegan side, you may experience fatigue and hunger for the first one to two weeks. That's just because your body's acclimating to this new diet. Also, you may experience constipation. You may only experience constipation within the first couple of days. Once you get through those couple of days, you will have more regular and frequent bowels. That's because of the high fiber intake you'll be having as a vegan. As a bariatric patient who is vegan, protein options are tofu, tempeh, seitan. Do you say seitan? Is that how you say it? Quinoa, which is a complete protein. You also want to fill up on those high fiber, non-starchy vegetables, such as broccoli, cabbage, spinach, yellow summer squash, zucchini, cauliflower, Brussels sprouts. You can also fill up on legumes. They are both a protein and a non-starchy legume. They also have a lot of fiber. Beans such as black beans, pinto beans, and garbanzo beans, which you can actually roast and have as a crunchy, salty snack. Lentils, fill up on all those beans. They'll also help you go to the bathroom. Just be careful who you're surrounded by. The cool thing about being a vegan is you get to experiment a lot with new flavors. Since some veggies and tofu, of course, can be very bland, you get to spice up your life with new flavorings, such as garlic, turmeric, curry, rosemary, dill, whatever you like, introduce those new flavors. Fortunately, these days, there are a lot of vegan options out there in grocery stores, and they offer a lot in restaurants now as well. Again, make sure you're eating that protein first, such as the tofu and the tempeh, the beans, and fill up on those non-starchy veggies. It is possible as a bariatric patient to be vegan. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up or comment below. If you are a vegan bariatric patient, we'd love to hear your comments on this video. Subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching. And follow Live Healthy MD on Facebook and Instagram. Take care.